Hello, hello everyone. Plagin again here. And we're back with another discussion about the 2021 summer season of anime. Today, we'll be talking about Battle Game in 5 Seconds. The premise of this one was a not-so-random high schooler gets abducted along with a bunch of other people, and they are set upon each other in these death game battle kind of things. Uh, essentially, they have these bracelets that lock their powers in. And when they meet, after five seconds goes by, the handcuffs unlock, unsealing their power and allowing them to fight. Uh, that's the basic premise there. Uh, so the main character is not so normal in the fact that he's like a very like hardcore gamer. Uh, and so he like takes to this pretty well in uh, developing his, like, strategy and stuff like that, since he's, uh, I think he's, like, a high, high-ranking, high like, video game uh, player for a specific, like, game or something like that. Anyway, the uh, show as a whole wasn't too bad. It uh, was a little stale at some parts, a little good in others. Uh, I like the concept with them, uh, like, being put into, like, this, this death battle kind of thing. It was interesting. Those those genre are kind of interesting. There's always, like, a, a will they die or not kind of dynamic, even though you know for sure that the main character ain't gonna die because they're the main character, of course. Um, however, still kind of interesting. So, uh, his power, particularly, which is, uh, his ability is whatever the other person thinks your ability is meaning he has to use his strategy to get his opponent or his allies to uh, think up what his ability is. So he has to, like, use some tact and, uh, like, kind of make them believe what he wants them to believe in order to get the ability he wants to win um, and that kind of stuff. And he ends up, you know, going from solo throughout the show to having, like, teammates or allies, but he really just seems like he's kind of using his allies because uh, he's not like a uh, normal person. He's kind of like a sociopath, I would say. But I don't know if that starts to go away at the end, or if it's just him really being convincing. Uh, so it's kind of interesting. It, it does seem like it sets up for there to be a second season. Uh, I'm not sure for sure. Because it did. The, the ending made it seem like, oh, there's going to be another season. But it wasn't for sure said in the show. You know how some have, like, the final card, like, see you next season or something like that, like in some of the more uh, obvious um, anime that are getting second seasons. This one I was kind of open-ended, so it could be interpreted as you are or are not getting a second season. Regardless, the show itself was decent, and I'll definitely be watching a second season if one comes out, and just to see how things further develop. Because uh, they're kind of still in the middle of the whole, like, death game thing. Uh, it, it's apparently broken up into different sections. The death game, there's, like, round one, round two, round three, round four. Um, but it's not just, like, single combat kind of stuff throughout the entire thing. It's, like, it goes from, like, being single combat to being group combat to being other stuff, blah, blah, blah. Um, so I'm curious what this next one is going to be if it continues. Because at the end, it, it seemed like something weird happened. Uh, by the like the last like frame of uh, the uh, the show on the last episode, so it was kind of interesting. Um, regardless, it's not the most original show, but it is a, a fairly decent show to check out if you're into the survival game kind of thing. Uh, so check that out, uh, and that'll wrap things up for me, everyone. So uh, real quick, we have two more shows to discuss after this, which is Higurashi's. Uh, latest season, and then the, uh, the It Attend Deities Only No Peace, uh, which is... I know Higurashi is going to wrap up on the 30th. Um, that's for sure. So that one will definitely be out here pretty quick. But the It Attend one, I'm not sure. It says that it's going to air until October 1st, which would be Friday. However, it also says it's only 11 episodes, which if that's true... That's weird. That it doesn't have 12. Throwing it out there. Because I'm, I'm thinking 
what exactly they can do in the last episode that they have. And uh, I, I can't think how they're going to do it. Because currently there, there's 10 episodes out, so we're just waiting for that last one um, to see what goes on. Very interesting. Anyway, we'll talk about those when they come up. And uh, I already checked out some of the new anime that's coming out next month. And it's going to be fun, y'all. So uh, I hope y'all enjoy that season as well. So until next time, everyone, I will catch you later. Bye for now.